Hello, and welcome to 5 Minutes About Pulsar. My name is Christophe Bornet, and I'm on a streaming team at Datastax. Today, we are going to see how to create Pulsar functions in Python. First, let's see what are Pulsar functions. Pulsar functions are lightweight stream processing components managed by Pulsar. They consume messages from one or more topics, then apply the logic you write in the language of your choice, and eventually, they may write the processed messages to an output topic. In this tutorial, we will see how to write and deploy a function written in Python. It will consume string messages from the topic example input, uppercase the string payload, and write a message with the uppercase string to the topic named uppercased. We'll then use the Pulsar client to produce messages to the example input topic and consume from the topic uppercased. For convenience, I'll use an Astra streaming instance in this demo, but you can do the same on another Pulsar deployment such as a local standalone one. We start by creating the example input topic. Then we create the uppercase topic. Let's now see how to write the Python code for the uppercase function. There are several ways to write a Pulsar function in Python. In this example, I use the most basic one which is to write a Python function that must be named process. The process function has one argument, which is the payload of the message received by the function, and it returns the payload of the processed message. We will send strings to our function, so the input type we receive will be a Python string. To implement the uppercase function, we can call the built-in upper method on it and return it as a result of our function. And that's it. For complex use cases, there is also the possibility to write a function using the Pulsar Python SDK and extend the function class. This gives more possibilities on what you can do. For instance, you can get information from the function context, interact with it to read the user configuration provided by CLI, expose metrics, send logs to a dedicated topic and so on. Now that we have a Python file, we'll create the function in Pulsar. For this, we use the pulsar admin CLI and use the function create command. We pass the Python file to upload as dash dash pi argument. We also provide the class name. For the function I wrote, the class name is the name of the Python module, so uppercase. We also need to provide the tenant and namespace of the function. For the input topics argument, you can provide a list of topics and use regexes. Here I only set the example input topic and uppercase for the output topic. Then I can launch the command and see that the function was created successfully. If I go back to my Astra streaming dashboard and go to the functions tab, I see that the function I just created is present and that its status is running. So it can process my messages. I'll now create a consumer using the Pulsar client CLI on the topic uppercase. And also create a producer with the Pulsar client CLI to produce messages on the example input topic. For instance, we send hello world. And we see that the consumer receives the message hello world uppercase. We can send another message for instance, hello Christoph, and we get it uppercase in the consumer. If you want a deployment of Pulsar ready to go, you can go to astra.datastacks.com slash register streaming and get a free Pulsar instance up and running. If you have any questions about today's video, you can email us at pulsarquestions at datastacks.com. That will reach the team at Datastacks. We'll be happy to answer any questions you may have. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please click the like button. That will make it easier for other people to find this video and grow the Pulsar community. If you are interested in other Pulsar topics, subscribe to our channel and get notified when new videos are added.